To Maya Denard, two weeks after being sentenced for corruption. But, you know, here I am, the reality of, of 18 months is definitely set in. Federal Judge Susan DeLotte delayed the start of her prison term because of the pandemic. The disgraced former lawmaker did not comment at the time, but she is now, saying she respects the judge's decision and regrets the way she let the community down. I mean, I addressed the court, but I haven't had a chance to really, you know, talk to people who supported me. So I just want to first apologize to the people of Cincinnati, the people who put their trust in me. I made a, a poor decision, a bad decision. One that tarnished the image of City Hall. Here she is being sworn in three years ago, the crowd buzzing with an air of fresh promise and perspective. We will have a roll call vote on the election of Tamaya Denard as President Pro Tem. The lighthearted moments. Councilmember Denard? Yes. Councilmember Lansman? Yes. And now the dead serious ones. I made a mistake that I have to live with for the rest of my life, regardless of you know how much time I spend in prison. Federal agents say she sold her votes, pay for play on development projects. She worked a plea deal admitting to wire fraud. She also admits the pain of falling short of the eyes of those who feel left out, the very people she vowed to help. And that's who, you know, I disappointed the most. Uh, and that's something that I, I, I own and I will continue to own that I will own forever, regardless of what I do next. Barred from elected office, next for her might involve advocating for women in prison most certainly some type of public service, instead of sitting around sulking about what used to be. My grandma said that used to bees don't make honey. And so I have to just kind of keep pressing forward. And depending on the pandemic situation, if Tamaya Denard does start her prison sentence on March the 1st, she tells me there's work to be done in there, that she cannot turn off her service switch, that whatever she does, she says she intends to try to do the best she can. Reporting live at City Hall, John London, WLWT News Fox.